Chicago at a rally last night. Listen to this. I had a small number of boxes in storage at Mar-a-Lago guarded by Secret Service and my people and everybody. I mean, it's safe. There is no crime. You know, there is no crime. It's not a crime. And they should give me immediately back everything that they've taken from me because it's mine. It's mine. So when you listen to that, does it make the attempt to blame that government agency look even more absurd? It does, Wolf. That is what prosecutors would call a confession for a crime. And the mere fact that you think it's not a crime doesn't change that fact. Look, Wolf, I can burn your house down. And if I burn your house down and say, you know what, I didn't commit arson. I was just playing with fire at Wolf's house. It's still an act of arson. And so it's, you know, whatever. We don't even need to explain that point. Look, this question of who packed what also adds is compounded by the fact that it's multiple communications from uh, the authorities with the folks at Mar-a-Lago. Every time they received an email at Mar-a-Lago, they were put on notice that what they were doing was illegal. And it all speaks to the intent, not just of the president, but other people around him. And it's going to come up in a criminal in a criminal charge at some point for somebody.